my name is Chad Tetzloff. I am the owner of CT Tattooing, um, based out of Northern Indiana. Um, so uh, what I've been asked, um, which I am going to get ready to do, is I was um, asked to check out the Bronco Hummingbird um, Rotary Tattoo Pin. If you don't know what a tattoo pin is, it's a big thing that actually just hit um, a lot of the uh, the uh, tattoo based out there of a lot of big name artists are starting to use um, the tattoo pins more than the coil tattoo machines. Um, there's a little bit difference of a, a tattoo machine, of a coil machine compared to a rotary machine. Rotary machine is a lot less quiet. Um, it's not as uh, smack dab like hurting, you know, on wrists or elbows of a tattoo artist. It's a lot easier on clients as well. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get into it. Um, what it is, like I said, it is a Bronco, a hummingbird tattoo pen. It is a rotary machine. I don't know if you can see it really good or not, um, but this is the box that it came in. Um, and I was fortunate enough to actually get one sent to me for uh, for review to check it out. Um, uh, the big announcement that I uh, had, um, I think it was like last Monday that I forgot to do, is um, now I am sponsored by um, a company named Big Wash. A lot of my needles and all my stuff from there. Um, they've been uh, sending me awesome products um, to check out to do a review. Um, so I like a lot of their needle groupings and stuff like that is amazingly good. Um, also too, like I said, here is actually the actual tattoo pin. Um, it says, I don't know if you can see it or not, it does say Bronco on it, which is the brand for it as well. Um, it is a hummingbird rotary machine. Um, is a lot better in my eyes than a coil machine. Some people prefer the coil machine over a um, over a rotary machine. Um, it, it did take me a little bit to get used to, um, but I would definitely, definitely highly recommend at least trying it out. Um, I know the prices on these range anywhere from uh, from two fifty to uh, four hundred dollars, um, and it's a well worth product. I mean, it's. It, for one, it's really, really stable. Um, it does have grips on it to where you can, when you're tattooing, you can take a better grip on the tattoo, uh, the tattoo pin itself. Um, which is, which a big difference is with the coil machine, it's more of the tapping. So that is basically the loud noise. Um, I don't want to say that it puts the the person in more pain because it's actually not really what it does. It is a little bit more painful. Um, it's a little bit more intense. Um, but with this type of machine, um, like I said, it doesn't tap. It basically is on a spindle that spins. So it's a lot quieter. Um, I think you get more smoother blends, a lot less trauma to the skin when you're getting tattooed by it. Um, I mean, there's all kinds of little things. It is a different setup than a coil machine. It does come in with needle cartilages, which I also get from Big Wasp as well. Um, so, I mean, it, it is a little bit to get used to. At first, um, I didn't really care for the tattoo pins, but I kept using it because I I was having pains in my wrist and my elbows, which now I don't have that pain at all. So it's very very satisfying that I could actually tattoo without pain in my uh, uh, my arm. Um, and like I said, a lot of people like it now because um, it, it's a lot less painful. It's quiet. Um, you don't have to yell over the per, you know your tattoo machines that are running um, to uh, to basically you know have a conversation. Um, with this, like I said, it, it's quiet. It has very, 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 very little vibration. Um, I do have other tattoo pens that I have been using. They have very, very little vibration, but it does have some. This one barely has any. Um, it's, it showcases basically um, you pay for what you get. Um, the other ones, I think I paid, uh, I think it was like 75 to 100. Um, I got two of them um, for one for shading and then one for uh, for lining as well. Um, so they both kind of work out. Um, with this also, uh, it's a little bit easier to adjust. The coil machine has, you know, your typical rubber band, your back spring, um, your coils itself. Um, you know, a lot of things that you have to adjust during your tattoo or before your tattoo. With this, you just basically insert your, um, your tattoo needle cartilage. And then when you spin the top of it, that's how you adjust the needle. Uh, So which is pretty good. Um, a lot of my clients now that I've been using this for this particular machine, I think I've been using for about probably about two or three months. Um, 
well, this, I guess, certain types. Um, this one I just got, um, which is awesome. I want to thank really uh, Big Wasp and the, their company, and especially Bronco, um, for believing in me. Um, I definitely, definitely like your guys' product. I highly, highly recommend it, um, especially if you're a tattoo artist or if you're getting tattooed. Um, like I said, it, it is a completely different um, way of what I've been used to, but I very and enjoying the change. Um, and like I said, it, it's really good. Uh, a lot of the clients like it because it's it's not as painful. It's more enjoyable. We can actually do it uh, to where we can have a conversation doing it. But like I said, yeah, it is. Um, it's hummingbird, uh, a hummingbird tattoo pen. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. I believe he's still. There you go. Sorry about that. It is made by Bronco. Um, I also have the website if you are interested in purchasing it or at least checking it out. Um, I can send you in the right direction. I can send you to the website as well. Um, it comes in a, that's another thing too. A lot of coil machines don't come in and actually really good box. This box um, was specially made for uh, this particular machine. Um, it also came with, um, let's see, it also came with a holder as well. I don't really use the holder as much. Um, it comes with some set of needles, some rubber bands as well. So, I mean, it's it's really awesome. Um, what I'll do is I'm going to go ahead and we'll take out like a needle cartilage and place it in so you can see it. I'm not going to really run the machine. Um, but, yeah, if you can see it, this is a uh, tattoo needle cartilage, which, like I said, kind of, it goes right into here. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take that out really quick so then we can see how it's placed in. Like I said, it's, it's easier. You can place it right in. It snaps in, and then you turn it to lock it, which it just did. And then, like I said, the top right here, the black part, you can easily adjust how you want the needle to go in or out, however you want it to hit the skin or whatever you're doing on your particular style of what you want to do. Um, and it holds really, really well, too. I think I have a mag, a flat mag that is about a 15 um, that I have used on it. And usually with coil machines, you got to have a heavy duty or <laughs> I said duty or, um, you got to have a highly um, uh, a bigger coil um, to run a, a 15 smoothly. With this one, like I said, it's. What's good about it is all you have to do is adjust it. It runs any kind of grouping. It runs curved mags, tight liners, round shaders, um, really, really anything. I mean, what I have in here now, I believe, is like a 13 tight line. You know, and like I said, you can adjust it. Um, it's ran fine. Um, and like I said, it's by Bronco. Like I said, I highly recommend it to check it out. Another thing, too, when you want to take it out, all you have to do is place your thumb here so you don't break the tube or the clip or clip the tip i cannot talk today you just twist it it unlocks and you pop it out pretty simple i mean it's it's not hard the groupings i really high, high recommend um either big wasp or uh or bug pin bug pin is really good too with the groupings um so is big wasp because if you look at some of the groupings or whatever when uh you're looking at your tattoo together on some of the coil machines when they send you tubes, which I've never had a problem with a, a needle cartilage. That's another big thing too, is if you look at the grouping of the, the needles, and if you have tubes for a coil machine, sometimes the needles are split apart, sometimes they're bent and stuff like that, and then it's almost a waste. With these, they're basically secured in a package, as you've seen, as I pull it out, sterilized, blah, 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 blah. I'm not using this on any way. This will go into the biohazard container. Um, but the the needle, if you can see it, I'm not too sure if you can see it, but it's actually located inside of the, the tube. So it's actually well fed, and I've never, ever had a problem since I've been buying the needles with any of the groupings of the needle set, uh, spaced apart or anything like that. So, like I said, it's it's pretty awesome. I would actually suggest this more for um, a beginning artist because like I said it's it's less vibration 
it's almost like you're taking an actual pen or a pencil and drawing with it. Instead of a coil machine, it has that constant vibration, which I still love coil machines. I still do use them sometimes. Um, just really depends on the mood that day, I guess. Um, but a, a coil machine is a little bit harder to learn from because of uh, the way it's set and it has a lot of vibration. Um, and when I say new tattoo artists, I'm not saying go out and buy one and then start trying it. When you do your apprenticeship <coughs> at a shop, check into these. You can even ask the guy that is mentoring you. See maybe if he's used them. <coughs> or at least a, a rotary machine. There are different kinds of rotary machines as well. Um, but yeah, with that being a review, I really, out of five, out of five, I really give a six star. I mean, like I said, it's a really great product. Um, it's by Bronco. Um, highly, highly recommend it. Um, you will not be disappointed at all. Another thing too, you will have to purchase a clip cord if it does not come with it. The clip cord is set up differently. Or the clipboard will have to go in here instead of your uh, uh, your hook that you hook into your coil machine. So it is a little bit different. And like I said, it's a little more pricey, but it's well worth it. You know, it's not uh, something that you pay high dollar for and you completely hate it. Um, but yeah, with that being said, like I said, uh, highly recommend it. Um, it's Bronco, a hummingbird, a rotary a tattoo pin. Um, there is other tattoo pins out there as well that you can check out. But I really, really, highly, really recommend Bronco um, and Big Wasp or Big uh, uh, Bug Pin for your uh, needle cartilages as well. And those are a little, little more high price than regular like needles and tubes disposables, but not too much more. Um, but yeah, with that being said, just wanted to give a review. Um, and it is live, um, so we will talk to you guys later. Like I said, check these out. If you need anything, um, any questions or anything like that, I am pretty sure I can answer them for you. Or um, I have the uh, the owner of it, of Big Wasp, that I can uh, shoot you a message to to where you can contact that person as well. So with that being said, I hope you guys have a great day. This is a review on a Bronco Hummingbird Rotary Tattoo Machine, Tattoo Pin. And um, we'll talk to you guys soon.